Yo, what is up everybody? Exus here and welcome back to Asgard's Fall Origins. Today we are going to be playing the lightning build, which gives lightning damage, increased lightning damage, shock chance, attack speed, movement speed. I'll let you read over these. 65% chance increase to a draw lightning ability. And then the big ones are shock, shocking vulnerability. Vulnerability through shock is increased by 25%. Gathering Storm increases lightning damage by 20% for every active lightning ability and chain lightning. Lightning abilities have a chance to cause a chain lightning hitting up to five enemies. Perfect. We're going to go to the max difficulty that we can go, which is just HP, but it's more XP. We're going to get in here and have some fun. How's everyone doing today? I hope everyone is doing well. I am doing fantastic. Excited to be trying another element. Elemental run, I was going to say. Um, so, yeah. Today will be lightning. The next video will be cold. And then the last video, we're going to grab Tears Anger. That's lightning. Perfect. Uh, will be the physical. So, we got... There's no date. Um, but the dev said... The full release is looking like um, quarter four of this year. And of course, that can always change. So there's not going to be, unless there's any significant changes, there's not going to be any videos after, you know, the physical video for quite a while. We'll grab the goon year. Um, but yeah, there, there's not going to be any videos for quite a while sadly but as soon as this game releases or there's a big patch or beta or whatever that i'm able to make videos on it will be back so if you are not subscribed and you want to see more of this when it does fully release hit that subscribe button help us out here we're getting very close to 3k subs which is pretty awesome so that's always fun but again, I do love that this changed to a 20 minute run, give or take. Oh, I ran right into that orb. And yeah, I still think lightning is probably going to be the weakest unless the evolutions are just actually insane. But I guess we'll find out here. Um. And grab the pulse and we're just gonna go with whatever the game decides to give us not gonna stress too much on singling out a spell this is free so if you wanted to try it you just search Asgard's fall on on Steam and it will pop up and it's free for now that, that's essential. I want to say that it's free for now. Uh, once the game releases, it, it won't be free. That'd be my guess, anyways. We still have the talent in the physical tree that has a chance of releasing more orbs or more. It basically can double your cast, I believe it is. I think, I think that's what it does. I can't remember. We're going to take Thor's hammer. Yeah, there'll still be daily videos on the channel. Not of this, though. Um, and sometimes two videos a day. Shock chance will take it. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm actually going to reroll. None of those were great. I will take lightning damage. Just getting flat lightning damage is really good. Shock is like kind of whatever, I think. I don't think it's terrible, but I don't think it's amazing. I need more dashes. One one dash ain't gonna cut it. Uh, I guess it's Thor's hammer. I'm kind of interested to see what the evolution of Thor's hammer would be. It's probably just more, <laughs> more hammers.
uh, crit attack speed. I do like both of those. So give me, give me both of those. Again, attack speed, I do believe is still, um, cooldown reduces every ability cooldown. Yep. The more attack speed you got, the better. Uh, Thor's Wrath. We have all the lightning skills. Cool. And I don't think there's extra ones. Like, I think Fire has an extra one. Or a sixth spell, I think. I don't think... I don't think Lightning has that. We'll take... Oh, that's a pretty good one. Pretty good one. So at 15 minutes, the elites will spawn at 10 minutes. Boss spawns 15 minutes the or 15 minutes in, I should say. Um, another set of elites and then boss at the end, which if you watched last video and spoilers, if you haven't, uh, that last boss is not killable yet. Now, visually, I'm going to grab every single one of these and get me some movement speed. Visually, I think I like lightning probably the best. Visually, um, cold is probably my favorite one to play, though, at least after they had their patch because cold was really weak. Fire and physical are by far the strongest. Physical being number one just because of its tree being absolutely ginormous. <laughs> I can't tell you how excited I am to have full trees for every single one. As long as I have a lightning skill, I'm not re-rolling, which might not be the best way to get evolved skills, but... I don't feel like re-rolling. I need more dashes. Movement speed, I'll take, oh, but we'll take every single one of these and just get more movement speed as well. Huge. Ah, oh, I didn't mean to grab the fruit. No, stay away from me, fruit. No, it ate it, it ate it. We were so close to full health. That was such a waste of an apple. That collection radius though, really uh, does work when you need fruit. I still think the, the Gungnir has no range. Like, you can just heave it. Yeah. I try my best to just aim at a group of enemies. Uh, which one is closer? We're going to take Pulse because it's level 3 now. I see lightning's still doing decent though. It's not doing bad. We are only seven minutes seven ish minutes in, but it's not doing bad. English is hard sometimes. Especially when you talk all day recording videos. Words just become harder and harder to say. Mouth gets dry. I have to always have something to drink on hand. I would take some health regen. Yes, please. Don't grab the apple. Let the health regen do its job. Perfect.
No, I thought he hit me. That's so many... So many uh, Yggdrasil balls. Alright, we got about two minutes until boss. I got hit there because I ran into him like an idiot. They all kind of spawned on me. I'm going to blame that. They spawned on me. Oh, same. And the game doesn't want to be a pal and give me like 14 dashes. It's kind of rude. I think that's kind of rude. Uh, hammer is three, but so is this. I think we take... This does more damage, so we're going to take that. Or at least it made the skill do more damage. I wonder how this is going to do against the boss. That's always the test. One minute until the boss arrives. And I am super tired today. So my wife leaves early for work and she says goodbye before she leaves. And like 80% of the time, I can't go back to sleep. <laughs> I thought I died. I'm not going to lie right there. Uh, all these suck except for I want that. And I'm going to take it. And most of the time I do not go to sleep at the same time as my wife. So I get a little bit less sleep. And I don't take naps very often. Like very, very, very rarely. Don't know. No oh, boss is here. I didn't even pay attention what time it was. Boss is here. Watch out. Oh no, here we go. Oh no. Hey, watch out. I'm gonna go with uh, lightning. Still not great against bosses. I don't think the Yagdrasil balls can double hit. I think they can only hit an enemy once. So let's just keep putting points into it, obviously. <laughs> Pretty sure you can iframe uh, I the the thing as well. The little hand. Oh yeah, this this boss is uh, not dying. I think we had this last this problem last time with lightning. That I don't think the boss can multiple hit by like the orbs or stuff like that. So it makes it only contact damage, the initial contact damage. Also, if they really want to make it interesting, the head, like if you run into the head, you take damage. I think the head should do something like, I don't know, like laser beam eyeballs, because why not? Or, I don't know, ground stomp or, that hurt. Go grab a, an apple.
think we got hit by that. I think we got hit by it. I think we mistimed it. He's only halfway gone. That's, uh, that is not good. Like, at all. So I'm thinking lightning probably still needs a buff. trying to stay close so I can melee him and you know just get a little extra damage all the enemies the way the enemies like swarm on him how oh we leveled uh I'm gonna reroll here I will take lightning damage. I'll take physical damage too, just so we can get the movement speed. I think we got hit by that. We did. I mistimed that. Okay, yeah, we got saved by the ton of apples on the ground. Ow. Please go away, Mr. Monster. Mr. Boss Man. Boy, I didn't know if that was going to go away or not. Uh, we're just going to grab this just because, well, we can evolve it. What is it going to evolve into? They're going everywhere. And now they have a cooler animation too. Okay. I dig that. I'd be lying if I said I didn't want to see the, the Gung years. Wow, we were fighting that boss for like five minutes. Because it's elite wave. That's crazy. And during the boss fight, uh, wow, we just got slammed. Uh, during the boss fight, less enemies spawn, which I really think that makes us really behind on levels. I do, I do believe. Let's just hope we survive because honestly don't 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 feel as strong fire was kind of good um uh, yes we just we're going thor's hammer ah the apple oh well we'll, just, we'll take the hill that is fine Yeah, like I don't know like what the difference is between the orbs besides they're going all kinds of directions. Uh, they have a cooler animation. Do they do more damage? Are they able to hit more than once on a target? 
It kind of makes sense since, you know, they're faster. They're a lot faster. If they hit more. But it's very hard to tell. It's real. I'll take lightning. I'll take all this. That's fine. That works. Got to take the big bad lightning damage. Wish there were some legendary lightnings though. Keep losing my cursor. I hope we get customizable cursors because this cursor gets lost in all the flashing white on the enemies when they get hit. Like on this game, I would change my color to probably blue just because there's nothing really blue going on. And it would be easier for me to see. And we're only level 27. That feels pretty bad. That feels really bad. I need some justice for lightning. I'm actually going to reroll here to try to get the hammer. I really want that, but hammer is the closest, so that's what we're going to grab. Try to at least get one more one more ability to be evolved. No, no. Making our way through. Ow, my face. <gasps> my face. All right, minute left. I think we still get another carving level up, which is not good. I wish it was kind of like um, Soulstone Survivor, where when you're this far in, you can. Like it'll, it'll take you to the carving menu, but you can say skip for skill level up or something. I don't know. I don't know if that'd be too busted if it's balanced around that. Probably not since it's not in the game, but it should. It should be because I don't know if I'm going to get another level in 37 seconds. So unfortunately, we're probably not going to get to evolve. And yes, I just risked my HP to go in the middle to get as many uh, XP orbs as I possibly could. I'm not going to lie, one evolve is kind of wild, right? Like that feels wild. And Odin is coming and I can't run from Odin, so you don't get me. Yeah, he just, he just gets you. It doesn't matter. <laughs> we survived for negative eight seconds afterwards. So, so eight seconds. Yeah. Um, it did good damage. Just the other stuff didn't. That could be an issue. But that was still fun. Um, unfortunately, we weren't able to showcase many skills there. The evolved versions. But we still had fun. If you enjoyed this video and you do want to see more of it, let me know down below. Leave a comment. Tell me hi. Tell me what you think of this game. Like and subscribe. It really helps out the channel greatly. It helps me grow. It defeats that algorithm. It pushes it out to more people. And most of all, I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful day. Take care and we'll see you next time. See ya.